Gemüse. Ah, hier ist es. Cleaned up the garage. Built up this new shelving here. And now I can't find shit anymore. We are charging, charging the battery with grid power. I need to show you why. Remember in one of the last videos I installed the new BMS here in the off-grid garage? And I think it's not working. I cannot get the balance function to work. So when I go into function settings, the balance is enabled and the charge balance is enabled. This is all turned on. And here in all the settings, see, I have set the balance turn on voltage to a 3.33 volt with a balance precision of 30 millivolt. So that's what the BMS is set to. So 3.33, that's this one, this one. I need to turn off the light. I need more power going in the battery okay so we're now charging with 190 watts now well this well this was actually the discharge the outside light was still on uh we've got now battery number 13 on 3.333 volts so over the set threshold down there and we've got several other cells over 3.3 volts right 3.33 volts, 3.33. Actually, most of them now have 3.3 volts. We've got only four millivolt deviation, so that's good. But all these battery cells, they should be balanced now. Okay, here are all the parameters again. Here we've got the balance turn on voltage, 3.33, right? And there's no balancing happening at all. Nothing. Zero. Nada. What the frog? So I contacted QUCC. You can actually directly talk to them via AliExpress. And I sent them all the screenshots and say, what the frog is going on? And they replied and say, 3.35 or 3.4 or 3.5, please. 3.35 is the minimum. And I said, what the hell is going on? The old BMS, the old electronic, which looks exactly the same as the new one. I know when I had the BMS new and I wanted to test the balance function, I set it to 3.1 or something, so totally low, and it started balancing all the cells. I could set any voltage I wanted and it always worked. But now they are claiming 3.35 is the minimum voltage you have to set. And I've asked them, well, does the new BMS has a new firmware? What has changed? Is this a different electronic? Well, they didn't really reply to this question. So I'm just following their advice now. And I'm trying to recharge the battery. <laughs> because it's freaking nighttime. I have connected the grid charger now and charge up the battery just a little bit to see if it actually kicks in at 3.35. I don't think it will because it was sitting on 3.35 before. No, it was actually sitting on 3.351. Here, here, here. Here, look at my screenshots. 3.351 and uh, 20 millivolt deviation yeah so that's what i have set it to and it was always working like this with the old electronic no problem here at all but now this doesn't seem to work here anymore for some reason i don't know why all right so okay let's set this to 3.35 as they recommend and the balance precision to 30 millivolt this is all good and clear now right
Mm, well, then we have to wait until the battery is charging up to a 3.35. It shouldn't take too long, actually. Well, if this is not working, I can already see me Frankenstein something together with the old electronic and the new relay and making this all work. I don't know. I've got the suspicion there's something wrong with the electronic in the QUCC BMS they have sent me a couple of weeks ago. Everything else seems to work fine, but the balancing, I'm not sure. Why would they have a lower threshold now in there? While before with the same electronic, it looks the same. I could set any voltage I wanted. Any. Now, I don't want to recharge the battery with a grid charger, actually. So let's wait until tomorrow morning until the sun comes back. Yeah, the long AGM test is still running here. And of course, I'm far too impatient to wait until tomorrow to test the BMS. So I have um, plugged in the grid charger again, and we are now at 3.35 volts with almost all. This one is not, this one is not. Still 5 millivolt deviation, so that's pretty good. Let's check the functions again. Balance enabled, charge balance enabled, uh, 3.35 and 30 millivolt precision. That's what they recommended. And from what I can see, balancing is still not working. Why is the voltage? Ah, the outside light turned on again. Ah. Okay, we have to wait two or three minutes now. <laughs> Balancing is working again. It is working. And they told me bullshit. What the issue was, many of you have probably already seen it in the video and I didn't pick this one up. When we have a look at the parameters again, I had set the precision as they recommended to 0 0.03, which is 30 millivolt. And I'm always, always highlighting that my deviation, that my precision is only between two and 10 millivolt. And if I set the precision to 30 millivolt and my actual batteries are under these 30 millivolt, there will be no balancing. I usually have the precision set to one millivolt deviation. So we are writing the parameters back and if we now go back into the actual battery we can see all of the cells are balancing now because our deviation is above this one millivolt and before that we had 30 millivolt as threshold set. <laughs> For some reason this parameter has reset or something or changed when we changed the actual BMS, the hardware. I did not see that. I didn't see that. Well, I make this video anyway, just to <laughs> make other people aware of that. If your balancing is not working, <laughs> that's maybe why. And now we can go back into the settings and I'm sure I can set any voltage whatsoever um, where are we? Here. So I can set 3.2 volts, for example, and then we go back and all the cells should be balancing now. Apart from this one, this is the lowest one. What a beginner mistake. Mm. <clears throat> I'm chasing this for days. Since I replaced the BMS, I'm chasing this and I checked all the parameters a million gazillion times and I did not pick up that the threshold is set to 30 millivolt. <sighs> all right, I'm setting the balance turn on voltage now to 3.351 volts again. 
as I had it before. And the precision can stay on one millivolt, that's totally fine. And then balancing commences because we are over 3.351. Why do I set it to 3.351 volts and not to 3.35 volts? Well, I'll tell you in a future video, I have changed the settings for balancing because I experienced, I don't think balancing at a high state of charge is actually useful. So I float at 53.6 volts, which is 3.35 volt per cell. And then my balancing kicks in as well at this point of time. As you can see, it is fairly effective, right? Five millivolt deviation we have. It seems to work quite well and I'm pretty happy and balanced with my pack here. So, okay, balancing is working again. I can write QUCC again. It was only the setting of my precision, of my voltage difference between the cells, which was not set correctly. Everything is good, everything is working, the BMS works as designed. Alright guys, anyway, so far this video from today, I was under the impression the BMS is not working and the balancing is not working for some reason. Well, I figured it out myself now. I hope you learned something from that, so check your parameters. <laughs> Most likely it is yourself which is causing the issue. <laughs> All right, guys, stay charged, stay safe, and we shall see us again in the next video coming out very soon on this channel here. See you then in the off-grid garage. Bye-bye.